Itra's headlamp goes dark, blinding Danae's footing on the rocky terrain. She stumbles forward and grasps the back of his damp shirt for balance. He plays with the switch and shakes the headlamp. He attempts to step through but smashes the bridge of his nose on the stones. He mutters a curse and bends lower, clearing the opening. Crunch. What was that? Danae panics. Watch your head, Itra says. It's low. He interlocks his fingers with hers and thumbs her wedding ring. She drags her free hand over her head and feels the smooth stones as she steps under. Crunch. Itra's headlamp flares back to life. Danae's head snaps up. She follows the beam as he scans the area, revealing a small clearing, a few rocks, grass, and an open space. Did we step on glass? Danae asks. In contrast with the darkness, gold reflections dance with an orange-gold shimmer under their feet, highlighted by the single beam. Does it remind you of hot coals? He asks. Or lava? She adds. <laughs>